day everyone so today I'll be teaching you how to do basic flower arrangements its rules necessary materials and the things to consider before arranging flowers flowers can make people happy could lighten the mood can enhance the aura or scenery of a place and can set a good impression to the people or to the surrounding so to start we must know the basic rules in arranging flowers first because through it we can arrange flowers in a unique fast and easy way that would seem like touched by a professional first is the scale it is important to know in order for you to make the arrangement not too small or too big in the area that it will be projected after all we don't want our flower to occupy all of the space or not be seen at all second is color because you have to consider also the feelings that you want to capture or to express through the flowers that you will be arranging so that is to say you have to be considerate to the person or to the place that it will be sent or projected like example in the funeral red is most likely unwelcome third is texture four it will make your arrangement visually interesting and will look like it is arranged by a professional in short i am not telling you to touch or to feel the flowers but to begin in choosing the flower size or shape that you will be using in your arrangement fourth is dominance for it will be the one that will captivate not just the eyes but also the heart of your viewer a highlight in the arrangement is the one that make it noticeable and stand out and will remain in the mind of the people that can see it lastly is balance after all you will not arrange your flowers that will look like it is unfinished or half faced only the main course and I want you to listen carefully and to look closer as I introduce to you the steps and how to arrange the flowers all together at once first is we must gather and arrange all the materials needed so we could work smoothly so we have here a pruning shear but if you don't have one you can use a clipper or a scissor and a corn stripper if you have roses then next is a florin pole or flower frog and also a pot to put your foam into also in some cases we can use banana trunk to save expenses and if your arrangement require a vase then you must also have a water ready and of course don't forget your flowers in some occasion of arrangement you might need a floral tape or chicken wire preservative solution or bleach and to make you safe while arranging flowers wearing gloves is a smart way second is to make your pot and foam ready here it is third is we must cut the flowers or leaves correctly usually the stems are snipped at an angle like this like this and leaves should be cut so the energy from the water will be directed to the bloom fourth is you can start adding the largest flower first and you can turn the arrangement around just to make sure the arrangement is symmetrical so we're adding the largest flower first then we can add the foliage here in the side
is try to create a mix of complementary colors or you could need get a layer or you could layer your arrangement like according to their hierarchy that is I am placing the stronger or longer stems first and then fill it with sturdy blooms and foliage sixth is filling fill your arrangement with greenery but keep it natural as much as possible trivia you can use eucalyptus leaves because aside from the fact that it comes from tons of varieties of shapes it also brings nice scent and its branches are also good in filling just as long as you are changing the waters regularly lastly is the changing of waters for it nourishes the flowers and prevents bacteria buildup flowers most of the time prefer room temperature so filling your vase with two-thirds of water with a sprinkle of water food could help your flower last longer than usual but above all your flower arrangement will most likely to stand up if you chose the flower you like for it has your heart then try to figure out what flower to use remember this cliche folks simplicity is beauty an arrangement that is arranged with a heart will most likely stand out thank you and god bless everyone